Hey y'all, how you doing? Welcome back to Truth Be Told, another edition of Truth. I just wanted to share something with you all today. I wanted to bless you. In the glorious name of Jesus, I pray that today God's favor is upon you. I pray today that is the day that everything breaks in your life, that the lies of the enemy are no longer uh, prevalent in your life, that your eyes and your ears are open to know the truth of who you are in Christ. I pray this today in the glorious name of Jesus. I stand in the gap and I pray against any assignment, any agenda, anything the enemy has against you or your family today. I pray that it is broken. It is rebuked. It is rejected in the name of Jesus because that is a name the name above every name in the universe. That name squashes and cancels out anything that he had against you today. So let's start to praise God and thank him for his promises. Psalms 91 says that God will charge his angels to go before you, to guard you in all your ways. Honey, you need to pray that every single day because you don't forget that you got an enemy that's trying to kill you and take you out, trying to divide, destroy, and conquer. Uh, that's what he does. So let's not be surprised when he comes at us, because he's coming for us, okay? Especially if you're a threat to his kingdom, you better, woo, honey, you better stay guarded up. <laughs> I pray this in the name of Jesus. I wanted to share my uh, my vision with y'all. My passion, because I, I was on that side, and I believed so many things in my life that were not true. And I lived my life based from that belief from that foundation that my life was a mess and I know that there's so many of us that are still living like that today because we got one foot in and one foot out of the kingdom I'm sorry just don't work that way you know some people think I'm a fanatic I really don't care what they think I know that I'm doing what God has called me to do you know and every single one of us has a purpose it may not be on the pulpit but I guarantee you that the word of God tells you that if you believe in God, that you should be telling people about him. Because there are people that are <laughs> that are not going to make it, that are not fair and well, because they need hope. They need the truth of God in their lives. And if you know the truth, then it's your obligation to share it with people. So my goal, my dream is to disconnect people from the things of the world that keep you bound and tied up they keep you separate and keep you away from God and get you reconnected to the things of God you see it's really easy disconnect and reconnect that's my goal okay I can show you when you apply the word of God in your life how it changes the circumstance so if you're dealing with something and you're tired and sick and tired of dealing with it give me a call Give me a call and I can get you plugged in. I can get you reconnected to the source of all life, to the source and the creator that created you and that has a purpose for you so that he can fulfill the purpose that you that he created you for. Man, wouldn't that be amazing today? I pray this in the glorious name of Jesus. Uh, call me uh, and get reconnected to the vine, okay? Woo, the source of all power. I'm telling you, once you get connected, you just... Woo! Things start to happen, honey. I love you guys. I am on Connected Avenue and Power Lane. Where you at? Holla.